Okay, so I got this package today from Amazon. Now, I don't know what it is because I ordered two things from the same company. Um, I ordered some smart plugs from Tekken. I believe this is two individual smart plugs with a USB port, but the other thing I ordered is a wall mount six unit, but I think this is too small to be the six unit. So I think this is two individual units, so let us open this up and take a look. Um, so I wanted to add some more smart plugs to turn on and off things like light bulbs in my house. Um, I'm also looking for electricity monitoring to see how much energy I'm using, so I'm not sure if these ones have that or not. So we'll take a look. So my fingernails are too short, so I'm going to take an X-Acto blade and cut this open. So I've already unboxed one that has a pair of these. Um, yeah, there's a picture of it right there. So I've already done an unboxing of one of them that has a pair of these, except the other one doesn't have USB ports built in. So this one is was on sale on Amazon. So I figured, what the heck, let's take a look. This is the SP25 Smart Plug. Okay. So there we have it two smart plugs. So this will allow me to turn it on and off electric devices um, using my either my phone or uh, my smart device such as Google Home or if you have Amazon Alexa or presumably um, Apple Siri. I'm sure you can do with that too but um, basically Amazon and Google will let you turn on and off devices with your voice. I do a lot of that, so I wanted to add a few more. Um, so here they are. Let me plug this thing in and then we'll see um, what it can do. Okay, so I've got a um, power cord, an, an extension cord. We'll connect these devices in. Okay, so the light is flashing, so that's a good sign. Um, you're supposed to use an app called Smart Life, uh, but I'm using a different one that's also compatible called Smart Light, just because that's what I have set up with my home device. Okay, so I'm going to connect, while I record the screen here, I'm going to connect to Smart Light and see if I can add the device. So I'm just going to click Add Plugs and I'm going to choose my Wi-Fi, confirm that it's slow blinking and then I gotta change my Wi-Fi to the smart plug. Oh, I say that's quick blinking, so let me hold it down for five seconds. And hopefully that's slow blinking. There we go, slow blinking. So sometimes when you turn it on, it's quick blinking, which means it's just a easy setup, I guess you could call it. Um, but when it's slow blinking, it creates a access point that you can connect to. Okay, so it looks like I'm connected. And now I've got the adding device, so hopefully this will be successful. If you hear any background sounds, that's just the sound of my cat doing cat things. 
Okay, so it looks like it got added successfully. I'll click Done. Right now it doesn't have a name, it just says Smart Socket. So we can see here what it can do. I can turn it off. So right now there's no power to the socket. I can turn it on. Um, there's a separate thing for the USB, so I guess I can power off the USB and power it on. Um, I can uh, set timers to turn it on and off. It doesn't look like that I can measure the electricity like I can with my other one, but that's kind of expected. I did pay less for this one, and it comes with a USB port, so um, no surprise there. Anyway, so that in a nutshell is my Tekken SP25 smart plug. I'll be able to use this to turn on and off things like my uh, humidifier, my air filtration, my any of my, any of my lamps that aren't currently on smart plugs, I can do that. But any of my bigger power things like my refrigerator, freezer, things that I want to measure my electricity with, I'm not going to use this with. Thanks for watching.